Yo, what is up, everybody? <clears throat> I'm finally here, man. Here to go over review reaction of Rap Devil by MGK. Um, I've heard it before. That's why I called it a review and a reaction. So I get to share my thoughts, my feelings toward this whole Eminem diss with you, with you all. Um, M listeners, MGK listeners, my following. Um, yeah, uh, I'm coming off the Funk Flex uh, freestyle with MGK. It wasn't about Eminem. It was about G-Eazy, but it's part, of the, it's part of the journey, so that's why I threw it in there. But uh, before that, I did the uh, Not Alike Kamikaze. And actually going back and reading the lyrics because Eminem fan stands kind of got on me about um, just my thoughts on it. Um, yeah, I, I, did, I did go back and read the lyrics. And I, I, I said it was light, but it, it, it wasn't. <laughs> um, Eminem did his thing on that. And just the, you know, just classic M with schemes and flow and wordplay, just the whole thing, right? So it wasn't light. Not a like was, was pretty great. I, I must say it was a, I, w I wouldn't say jab, but it was a hard punch, uh, maybe a few punches toward uh, uh, MGK. So respect. Um, and yeah, I'm getting a lot of dislikes on that video, which I, I assumed it would happen, you know? Um, so here we are, man. Here we are with Rap Devil, MGK. I'm going to give my thoughts here and there, but I, I'm going to save a lot of my thoughts for after the, after the song and after the disc, okay? So here we go. Rap Devil, MGK. If you're new to the channel, um, MGK fan or not, hopefully I do enough to earn yourself this reaction. Uh, if you're an Eminem fan, you are welcome as well. I welcome all stands. Um, I'm going to do Kill Shot after this. I'm actually going to record it after this and then release it a day after this. So um, you're welcome to. Hopefully I do another turn your sub, man. I'm not going to uh, do your boy M that bad. So, Oh, yes. What, 2018? What a time. <laughs> Oh my god, Ronnie. Oh my god, Ronnie. Hey, somebody grab me some clippers. This fucking beard is weird. Tough talk from a rapper paying millions for security a year. I think my dad's gone crazy. Yeah, Haley, you right. Dad's always mad, cooped up in the studio, yelling at the mic. You sober him. Am I the only one that thought the same thing when I when there was a when Eminem released a like a selfie, or not a selfie, but like a, a shot of his face with a beard? Um, when I was kind of going around social media, I said that I said the exact same thing. I was like, "That's weird. Like, it looks weird because Eminem has always had a clean, clean face, and never facial hair. So when that photo came out of M with a beard, I said the exact same thing. I was like, "That is weird. It looks weird. You know, no disrespect. I'm just not used to seeing that. You know, all my years of seeing M's faces, you know, it's, it's just a little weird. But I thought I thought that was very funny, petty." shot from mgk but it, i thought it was funny um but the whole like i think my dad's going crazy Haley, yeah you, like yeah Haley, you right i thought that was hard talking about the eminem song uh my dad's going crazy tough man i love the m song by the way tough talk from a rapper paying millions for security a year i think my dad's going crazy yeah Haley, you right Dad's always mad, cooped up in the studio, yelling at the mic. You sober and bored, huh? I know. I'm about to be 46 years old, dog. Talking about, I'ma call up Trick Trick. Man, you sound like a bitch, bitch. Man, I can handle your shit. You mad about something I said in 2012? Took you six years and a surprise album just to come with a diss? Homie, we get it. We know that you're the greatest rapper alive. Fucking dweeb, all you do is read the dictionary and stay inside. Fuck rap God, I'm the rap devil. Come a bare face with a black shovel like the Armageddon. When the smoke settle, his body next to this instrumental. I'm saying, I'm sick of them sweatsuits and them corny hats. Let's talk about it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's talk about it. Both of us single dads from the Midwest. We can talk about it. Or we can get gully. Y'all size up your body and put some white chalk around it. That's hard. Let's talk about the fact you... I think verse one might be the pettiest verse of the four. Um, just these little things, right? But I think I think I just think it's it's funny. Uh, Black bottle rapper that's twice. Let's talk about it. Both of us single dads from the Midwest. We can talk about it. 
Or we can get gully, I'll size up your body and put some white chalk around it. Hey. Let's talk about the fact you actually blackball a rapper that's twice as young as you. Talk. Let's call Sway, ask why I can't go up to Shea 45 because of you. Let's ask Interscope how you had Paul Rosenberg trying to shelf me. Still can't cover up the facts, your last four albums as bad as your selfie. Now tell me, what are you staying for? What? I know you can't stand yourself. Bro. Trying to be the old you so bad you stand yourself. Let's leave all the beef in the 50. Please. I'm not gonna lie, that that punch of like you trying to be the old you so bad you stand yourself. That might be one of my favorite punches at him in this whole song. It, it's one of them, and there's a few more in this, but that might be one of my favorite. You, you know, stand the song by Eminem, but I think it was just a clever way of bringing in that song. In that bar, but yeah, having a bar with that song, it's like you are killing yourself to trying to be the old Jew so bad. Oh my gosh, I thought that, yeah, I thought that was hard. I'm not gonna lie, I thought that was hard. But um, the whole thing with the blackballing and everything, and like Rosenberg trying to shelf him, and uh, you know, Sway, he can't go up to Sway. He he, he might have taken a small thing. And kind of blew it out of proportion, maybe. I don't know, but I know Eminem owns it, but I don't know. It, it seems a bit of a stretch. I could be wrong. Maybe you got you Eminem or not Eminem. MGK fans may uh, enlighten me on that whole situation. Let me know, man. Push a fifty. Now tell me, what are you staying for? What? I know you can't stand yourself. Bro. Trying to be the old you so bad you stand yourself. Ah, Let's leave all the beef in the fifty. Please. And push a fifty. Why you claiming I'ma call Puff when you the one that called Diddy? Facts. Then you went and called Jimmy. Facts. The coppers called me in the morning. They told me you mad about a tweet. You wanted me to say sorry. I swear to God I ain't believe him. Please say it ain't so. The big bad bully of the rap game can't take a fucking joke. Oh, you want some fucking smoke, but not literally you'll choke. Yeah, I'll acknowledge you're the dope, but I'm the gunner, bitch. I got you in the scope. Don't have a heart attack now. Somebody help your man's up. Knees weak or old age. The real slim shady can't stand up. I'm sick of them sweatsuits. I'm Corny hats, let's talk about it. So the tweet, right? The tweet that he mentioned in that verse, him, I'm guessing it's a tweet about his daughter. You know, MGK tweeted about uh, Haley when she was about 16 years old and said, and he said like, she looks great or looks fine for a 16 year old or whatever. I don't know what the exact words are. But um, again, like, I don't know what dad wouldn't be mad at another grown man saying my my I, I, my 16 year old daughter looks fine like it's going to do something to a father right so i don't know i'm on the M side of that whole thing like the whole tweet thing like sh- i would be mad too like if it was my daughter like of course again there's a lot of a lot of stories in that a lot of behind the scenes stuff in that uh verse May have holes, may have not. I don't know. I know Eminem got on Sway, did that whole interview thing of um, kind of explaining his side of that whole, like, I didn't say this. I didn't say that about, like, shuffling him or anything like that. So, I don't know. I guess you can believe whoever you want to believe on that stuff. So, you being rich and you still mad. Let's talk about it. Of a single dash in the Midwest, we can talk about it. Or we can get gully, I'll size up your body and put some white chalk around. That's hard. Hello, Marshall. My name's Colson. You should go back to recovery. I know your ego is hurting just knowing that all of your fans discovered me. Hi. He like, damn, he a younger me. Except he dresses better and I'm ugly. Always making fun of me. Stop all the thuggery, Marshall. You living in luxury. Hey, look what you've done to me. Drop an album just because of me. Damn, you in love with me. You got money, but I'm hungry. I like it this, but you won't say them lyrics out in front of me. Shout out to every rapper that's up under me. Know that I'll never do you like this fuckery. Still bitter after every one loves you. Pull that wedgie out your dungarees. I gotta respect the OGs, and I know most of them personally. Hey, but you just a bully acting like a baby, so I gotta read you in nursery. I'm the ghost of the future, and you just have a Scrooge. I said I'm flex, anyone can get it. I ain't know it would be you. I'm sick of them sweatsuits and them corny hats. Let's talk about it. I'm sick of you. Be- I think this might have been the um, the lighter verse of the four. Verse three. Um, I think it's funny how he kept he keeps on poking at like he's an old grumpy man <laughs> in different ways throughout each verse. I think it's funny. Um, yeah, very very light verse though. Very very light verse. Rich and you still mad? Let's talk about it. 
Bob of a single dad's from the Midwest, we can talk about it. Or we can get gully, I'll size up your body and put some white chalk around it. Hey, ride a shoddy, cause I got a road, it's dope, it's a fast road. When your idols become your rivals, yeah. Mm. Never hesitate to say it to your face, I'm an asshole. Oh Before we get into this last verse, I just want to say that bridge, I don't know what you call that, whatever whole auto tune thing right there. Not a fan of. I respect it, but I'm not a fan of it. Just the way it sounds, I don't know. I think it should have just went straight to the fourth. Um, but yeah, that that, that uh, chorus is. I, I like it. The chorus is the chorus is crazy on this. Fuck hell. We know you get it's a fast road. Let's go, man. Fourth verse. Never as it's my favorite verse. To your face, I'm an asshole. Oh my ass God, fuck out. We know you get nervous, rabbit. I see mama spaghetti all over your sweater. I wish you would lose yourself in the records that you made a decade ago. They were better. According to them, you're a national treasure. To me, you're soft as a feather. The type to be scared to ask Rihanna for a number. Just hold her umbrella. Ella, Ella. I'm not a fan. Okay, Oscar the Grouch. Chill on the couch. Fuck. You got an Oscar. Damn. Can anyone else get some food in? Nah, man. The whole, like, be rabbit spaghetti on the sweater. Like, I thought that was hard. I thought that was super hard, man. But I love the ask Rihanna for a number. Hold on, brother. LL. I, I love that. I loved it. You were soft as a feather. The kill. We know you get nervous, rabbit. I see mama spaghetti all over your sweater. I wish you would lose yourself in the records that you made a decade ago. They were better. According to them, you're a national treasure. To me, you were soft as a feather. The type to be scared to ask Rihanna for a number. Just hold her umbrella. Ella, Ella. I'm not a fan. Okay, Oscar the Grouch. Chill on the couch. Fuck. You got an Oscar. Damn. Can anyone else get some food in their mouth? For real. They made a movie about you. You and everybody's top ten. You're not getting better with time. It's fine. Eminem, put down the pen. Mm. Or write an apology. Or with a simple fact, you had a diss to ignore. Acknowledge me. I am the prodigy. How could I even look up to you? You ain't as tall as me. Five eight, man. I'm six four. Seven punches hold your head still. Last time you saw eight mile was at home on a treadmill. That's you were named crazy. after a candy. I was named after a gangster. <laughs> and don't be a sucker and take my verse off of Yellow Wolf's album. Thank you. Thank you. I just wanna feed my daughter. You try to stop the money to support her. You don't wanna always talk about the action. Text me to Addy. I'm pulling up scrapping. And I'm by my fucking self. What's happening? EST cap to salute me or shoot me. That's what he's gonna have to do to me when he realizes that it ain't shit he can do to me. Every Everybody always hated me. This isn't anything new to me. Yeah, there's a difference between us. I got all of my shit without Dre producing me. I know you're not used to me. Usually one of your disses should ruin me. But bitch, I'm a Cleveland. Everybody quiet this evening. I'm reading the eulogy. He dropped an album called Kamikaze. So that means he killed him. Already fucked one rapper's girl this week. Don't make me call Kim. I'm sick of them sweatsuits and corny hats. Let's talk about it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's talk about it. Bob of a single dad's from the Midwest. We can talk about it. Or we can get gully, y'all size up your body and put some white chalk around it. Let me talk to y'all, man. Um, I thought it was a really good diss. A lot of petty jabs, yes. But the few haymakers that he said in this, I thought landed. To me, again, high on the petty level. Very, very petty. But I thought the, the haymakers that landed were hard to me. Um, that Dr. Dre was producing me. Um, the real some shady can't stand up because he's his knees are weak or whatever. That and then um, trying to be the old you, trying to be the old you so bad you stand yourself. I think those three, those landed to me. But again, there's there's a lot in these four verses, um, backstories, stuff like that. Um, a lot of petty jabs though. A lot of petty jabs, very um, personal light jabs to me on a on a beef level. But I, I, as a song, I think it's I think it's dope. Um, I, again, I think the chorus is really good. I enjoy the chorus. Um, at the top of my head, this might be the best diss ver or diss track I've heard from uh, about M. Um, I feel like when people try to diss M, they get out of, out of character a bit and they try to do things that M does or they try to imitate M in a way and they make themselves look stupid. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like people try to um, rap like him, um, you know, put on that voice that Eminem likes to do, that comedic, uh, you know, he get, he kind of has a, a bit of a humor when he raps sometimes, he kind of gets in that character a bit. 
I feel like rappers try to do that. They get out of character and their disses are terrible. Um, I feel like a lot of them are like that. Um, I, this might be one of the best diss tracks towards them. Um, again, I can't think of many that come to this level, but all in all, I, I think this is a solid diss track. Um, yeah, man. I, I, th I think it's solid. Um, I'm going to do a kill shot. I'm going to record my kill shot reaction right now after the, I finish this video. And that will be released um, the day after I drop this. So um, Wednesday, you'll see the kill shot. And um, yeah, man, I'm going to be honest. I'm straightforward. Um, now, on a scale of one to five, this diss track, you know, I was really, really high on this diss track when I first heard it back in 2018. I'm going to give this diss track a, a 3.5. I think it's good. I think it's really good. Um, a 3.5 out of 5 diss track for me. Yeah, 3.5. So, that's my thoughts, my um, reaction to Rap Devil. But yeah, man. Lace up, EST for life. All my MGK fans, thank you for showing love. Eminem fans as well. Be on the lookout for my uh, kill shot reaction dropping Wednesday, okay? Non-biased MGK fan here. And also, Eminem's in my top five all time. Uh, probably one of the greatest lyricists of all time. So, that's where I stand with him. But yeah, I'll see you guys on the next one. Keep it a book. Pop this shit. My shit different. Making the kills to pay the bills. You see the spots we living in. Tried your best to recreate me, but we not equivalent. Everybody hit food. Y'all on our ass sizzling, rushing like conditioning, yeah. Hopping that thing in our skirt, bad bitch.